Replace the Fab Four. Here's the royal who's been getting the most attention these days. Princess Margaret's granddaughter, also known as Margarita Armstrong Jones, has captivated the world with her beauty and boldness. She's been heralded as a symbol of the new generation, carrying on the royal legacy, and a great hope for the senior royals. Let's take a closer look at her. Margarita Armstrong Jones is a member of the British royal family whose heritage and striking resemblance to her late grandmother, Princess Margaret, have made her a figure of fascination for royal enthusiasts. As the daughter of David Armstrong Jones, second Earl of Snowden, and Serena Armstrong Jones, Countess of Snowden, Margarita carries the weight of a distinguished family history. Her paternal grandparents, Antony Armstrong Jones, the first Earl of Snowden, and Princess Margaret, the younger sister of Queen Elizabeth II, were key figures in 20th century British society and the royal family. Margarita, now a young adult, has stepped into the public eye, captivating royal watchers with her poise and elegance, qualities reminiscent of her late grandmother. Princess Margaret, known for her beauty, charisma, and sometimes rebellious spirit, was a beloved yet complex figure within the British royal family. Her vibrant personality often contrasted with the more reserved demeanor of her elder sister, Queen Elizabeth II, making her a fascinating subject of public interest throughout her life. Although Margarita Armstrong Jones never had the chance to meet her famous grandmother, Princess Margaret passed away just three months before Margarita was born, she has grown into a figure who many believe embodies Margaret's grace, style, and independent spirit. In November 2022, Margarita Armstrong Jones stepped into the spotlight at Tatler's Little Black Book Party, capturing attention with a striking fashion choice that paid homage to her royal lineage. Draped in a white fur coat, she instantly evoked memories of her late grandmother, Princess Margaret, who had worn a similar fur in 1951. This moment, where past and present seemed to collide, was symbolic of Margarita's ability to channel her royal heritage while carving out her own path. The white fur was not just a style statement, but a subtle nod to the influence her grandmother has had on her life, even though the two never met. By May 2023, Margarita was ready to open up about her personal connection to Princess Margaret in an interview for Tatler. In the feature, she revealed how deeply her grandmother has shaped her interests, particularly when it comes to jewelry. According to Margarita, her passion for jewelry can be traced back to Princess Margaret's own love of fine accessories. Princess Margaret was renowned for her impeccable taste and her personal jewelry collection, which often rivaled that of her elder sister, Queen Elizabeth II, in terms of elegance and significance. Margarita specifically mentioned her admiration for the engagement ring that her grandfather, Antony Armstrong Jones, gave to Princess Margaret. The ring, she described, was very simple and very small, reflecting an understated elegance that was timeless. She added that her grandfather likely intended for the ring to be a symbol of lasting beauty, free from the excess and extravagance often associated with royal jewelry. This perspective on jewelry, and perhaps life itself, shows how Margarita values the meaning and sentiment behind the objects that carry family history, rather than just their material worth. Growing up, Margarita's royal connections were always a central part of her life. Her proximity to the British royal family is undeniable. After all, she is the granddaughter of Queen Elizabeth II's younger sister, but one of the most public and memorable moments that truly solidified her ties to the royal family came in 2011, when she served as a bridesmaid at the wedding of the then Duke and Duchess of Cambridge, now the Prince and Princess of Wales. At just eight years old, Margarita charmed onlookers as part of the royal bridal party. Her participation in the wedding demonstrated how close she and her family were to the future King and Queen of England. The wedding was a major international event, watched by millions around the world, and Margarita's role placed her squarely in the public eye. Despite the attention, Margarita's parents ensured that she and her older brother, 
Charles Armstrong Jones, Viscount Linley, were raised with a certain degree of privacy. Shielded from the media glare that often follows members of the royal family, Margarita was able to grow up relatively out of the spotlight, attending school and developing her own interests without the constant scrutiny that some of her cousins, such as Prince William and Prince Harry, have had to endure. Fast forward to 2023, and many royal watchers were surprised to see how much Margarita had grown. Having lived much of her life out of the public eye, it was almost startling to realize that the young girl who had walked down the aisle as a bridesmaid in 2011 was now a 21-year-old woman, fully grown and stepping confidently into adulthood. Margarita Armstrong Jones spent her formative years attending Tudor Hall School, an all-girls boarding and day school in Banbury, Oxfordshire. Tudor Hall is known for its emphasis on academic excellence, individual growth, and fostering a sense of community among its students, which would have provided Margarita with a supportive and enriching environment during her teenage years. As a school for girls aged 11 to 18, Tudor Hall would have allowed Margarita to develop her interests and explore her talents in a setting far removed from the scrutiny of the public eye, which might have been particularly important given her family's royal connections. During her time at Tudor Hall, Margarita would have had the chance to forge her own identity and friendships while also benefiting from the privacy the school afforded her. Given that Margarita is part of the extended royal family, Growing up in such a secure and close-knit environment likely offered her some respite from the occasional media interest in her life. Tudor Hall's relatively low-profile status, compared to more famous schools attended by other members of the royal family, allowed her to blend in more seamlessly with her peers and focus on her education and personal growth. However, as Margarita was reaching the end of her school year in 2020, her family faced a difficult and public challenge. That year, her parents, David Armstrong Jones, 2nd Earl of Snowden, and Serena Armstrong Jones, Countess of Snowden, announced their decision to separate after 26 years of marriage. The news of their impending divorce came as a surprise to many, especially given their long-standing relationship and the fact that they had always appeared to be a united couple. At the time of the separation, a spokesperson for the Earl and Countess of Snowden released a statement saying, The Earl and Countess of Snowden have amicably agreed that their marriage has come to an end and that they shall be divorced. They ask that the press respect their privacy and that of their family. This statement emphasized the amicable nature of the split, though no details were provided regarding what specifically led to the breakdown of the marriage. Neither David nor Serena publicly commented on the reasons behind their separation, which kept the matter largely private despite the family's aristocratic status. For Margarita, the announcement likely marked a significant change in her personal life. Divorce, especially one involving parents who had been together for more than 25 years, can be an emotionally challenging experience, particularly for children. Although Margarita was in her late teens when her parents' separation was made public, it would have still been a pivotal moment in her life, possibly altering the family dynamics she had known for most of her upbringing. David and Serena Armstrong Jones had previously been perceived as a stable couple, raising their two children, Margarita and her older brother, Charles Armstrong Jones, Viscount Lindley, largely away from the public eye. David Armstrong Jones, Known for his work as a furniture maker and his role as chairman of Christie's UK, had always placed a strong emphasis on family time. In a 2011 interview with The Telegraph, David spoke about the importance of dedicating Sundays to his family. I devote Sundays to Serena and the children. It's great to have a day to be quiet, reflect, and laugh together, he said. This commitment to family time made the eventual news of the divorce more surprising to many who had followed the couple's life together. Despite the separation, both David and Serena remained committed to their children, and by all appearances they sought to maintain a respectful and harmonious relationship for the sake of Margarita and Charles. 
Divorce in aristocratic or royal circles can sometimes bring with it heightened media attention, but in the case of the Earl and Countess of Snowdon, they seem determined to shield their family from excessive public scrutiny. The family's request for privacy was largely respected, and the divorce proceeded without significant media fanfare. While many members of the British royal family are bound by duty, tradition, and public roles, Margarita has been afforded the freedom to pursue her passions away from the constant spotlight. This more private upbringing has allowed her to focus on creative endeavors, which have blossomed into successful business ventures and artistic projects. One of the most notable aspects of Margarita's creative pursuits is her thriving jewelry brand, Matita Jewelry. As the designer and owner of the brand, Margarita has drawn upon both her personal love of jewelry and her family's storied history with the craft. The name Matita, which is derived from Margarita's own name, reflects the deeply personal nature of her work. Her designs often shared on the brand's official Instagram account embody a sense of timeless elegance, reminiscent of her grandmother, Princess Margaret, and the understated yet sophisticated pieces she favored. Margarita's love for jewelry has always been rooted in her admiration for her grandmother's classic style. In an interview with Tatler in May 2023, Margarita spoke about how much her grandmother's jewelry choices have inspired her. Princess Margaret was known for her impeccable taste and carefully curated pieces, which were often elegant and understated. This influence is evident in Margarita's own designs, which tend to favor simplicity over ostentation, much like the engagement ring that her grandfather, Antony Armstrong Jones, gave to Princess Margaret. Margarita has described this ring as very simple and very small, yet timeless, a theme that is echoed in her jewelry brand's aesthetic. What makes Margarita's career in jewelry design even more special is its connection to her family legacy. Her grandfather, Antony Armstrong Jones, also designed jewelry, a lesser-known but cherished aspect of his artistic career. As a photographer, filmmaker, and designer, he was a man of many talents, and his creative spirit clearly lives on in Margarita. In fact, the jewelry-making tradition within the family seems to be a thread that connects the generations, with Margarita now carrying forward the craft in her own way. The combination of these influences, Princess Margaret's timeless taste and Antony Armstrong Jones's craftsmanship, has undoubtedly shaped Margarita's approach to design. In addition to her jewelry brand, Margarita has inherited her grandfather's talent and passion for photography. Antony Armstrong Jones, who became the first Earl of Snowdon, was one of the most celebrated photographers of his time, known for capturing iconic portraits of royalty and celebrities alike. His work combined technical brilliance with a unique ability to reveal the personality and humanity of his subjects. Margarita, inspired by his work and creative vision, has developed her own skills behind the camera. She maintains a personal photography account on Instagram where she showcases her burgeoning talent in photography. This platform allows her to express her artistic vision, separate from the commercial aspects of her jewelry brand. Margarita's photography often focuses on nature, moments of quiet beauty, and personal experiences, suggesting that her approach is more intimate and reflective, perhaps a contrast to the grand portraiture her grandfather was known for. Nonetheless, there is a clear through line in their shared love for visual storytelling. Margarita has spoken openly about how much her grandfather's work continues to inspire her. In the same Tatler interview, she acknowledged that growing up with such a creative figure had a lasting impact on her artistic development. Anthony Armstrong Jones's ability to bridge multiple creative disciplines, from photography to jewelry design, set an example for Margarita. She has embraced this versatility, pursuing both art forms with passion and skill. Her dual pursuits of jewelry design and photography reflect a modern aristocratic approach, blending tradition with individual expression.
While Margarita is connected to the royal family, her life diverges significantly from her senior royal cousins. Rather than being confined to public roles and royal duties, she has been able to cultivate a life centered around creativity and personal fulfillment. This autonomy is something that sets her apart from other members of the British royal family, and it allows her to pursue her career on her own terms. As of 2023, Margarita Armstrong Jones holds a unique position within the British royal family. She is 27th in line to the British throne, a significant but somewhat distant placement in the order of succession. While her place may seem far removed from the core of the royal family's public responsibilities, it nonetheless highlights her deep connection to the British monarchy. More interestingly, Margarita's position in the line of succession also places her as the third highest individual after her father, David Armstrong Jones, second Earl of Snowden, and her older brother, Charles Armstrong Jones, Viscount Linley, who is not descended from Queen Elizabeth II. This distinction sets Margarita apart from the numerous descendants of Queen Elizabeth II, many of whom occupy the higher rungs of the line of succession. Her connection to the throne is instead through her grandmother, Princess Margaret, the younger sister of Queen Elizabeth II. Princess Margaret, as the second daughter of King George VI and Queen Elizabeth the Queen Mother, was once second in line to the throne, following her elder sister. However, over time, as Queen Elizabeth II's children and grandchildren were born, Princess Margaret and her descendants, including Margarita, moved further down the line. Down the line. Margarita's place in the line of succession is also shaped by the fact that her father, David Armstrong Jones, is Princess Margaret's only son. As a grandson of King George VI through his mother, David Armstrong Jones inherited his place in the line of succession. As a result, Margarita, like her father and brother Charles, remains part of the extended royal family, though her role is less defined by public duties. While Margarita's senior royal cousins, such as Prince William and Prince Harry, are often in the public eye due to their proximity to the throne, Margarita and her immediate family have largely stayed out of the limelight, a fact that has allowed her to lead a more private life. What do you think about Margarita Armstrong Jones? Leave us your comments in the section below. We hope you have found this helpful video. Don't forget to leave a like, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like it. Thank you for watching this and see you in the next videos. Goodbye.